Welcome back, survivors. Today we have some thrilling news for all you Dying Light 2, Stay Human, and For Honor fans out there. Techland and Ubisoft are teaming up for an exhilarating crossover event in Dying Light 2 Stay Human, featuring iconic fighters from Ubisoft's For Honor. Starting November 21st at 4 p.m. and wrapping up on December 5th at the same time, players will encounter three formidable warrior types, Kensi, Wardens, and Berserkers. This special two-week event not only introduces these medieval combatants, complete with unique attack moves and behaviors, but also offers a bounty of rewards for engaging with them. Players can reap various rewards by taking on these warriors. Just by participating, players earn five Rage Boosters. Warming up in the event secures the Berserker's Hand Axe, both the weapon and its blueprint. Reaching personal milestones rewards players with a Berserker outfit and a Viking-themed paraglider. The most exciting part? If the entire gaming community achieves the collective global goal, everyone is rewarded with the Warlord's Shield Weapon Charm. But the excitement doesn't end there. Dying Light 2 players can also look forward to three special For Honor bundles. The Berserker Bundle, which includes all items earned from event goals, is available for purchase, alongside two other bundles. The Warden Bundle offers a Warden Longsword, its blueprint, a Warden Outfit, a Knight-themed Paraglider, and a Footman's Flail Charm. The Kenze Bundle features the Kenze's Nodachi Weapon and Blueprint, a Kenze Outfit, a Samurai Paraglider, and a Hidokiri's Mask Charm. Each bundle is up for grabs in the in-game shop for 500 DL points, adding an extra layer of excitement to the game. Thank you for joining us today, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more exciting news and updates. Stay vigilant, stay alive.